Hey, families are back to paying for lunch in school. Yeah, it can come at a challenging time, which means the burden of lunch debt can once again really hang over a child's head. Parents need to know that if a student passes a certain negative balance, they're going to be given an alternate lunch for the day, but the same is not promised for all meals. For example, Cobb County Schools will provide alternate meals for lunch, but not for breakfast. This issue can contribute to the increase in food insecurity in our communities. But Georgia nonprofit All for Lunch is working with schools to make sure that all children get the food they need despite what their lunch account says. We work with donors throughout our community that are funding these accounts to make sure that these children are having their lunch debt paid off where their families can't afford it. But then we're also funding these reserve accounts so that these kids can continue to have access to lunch at school, um, even if they don't have the money to buy the lunch. And some districts are getting creative to solve the problem. Fulton County has started its own principal accounts to help with lunch debt. The funds cover the cost of a student's lunch if they're not able to pay. All for Lunch strongly encourages families to complete the free and reduced lunch waiver to lower their lunch costs. But they believe universal free lunch is the ultimate solution.